Hello and welcome to Regular Tech Reviews. Today I'll be reviewing my microwave. So, this is a microwave from Aldi. It's called Sterling. Uh, I haven't named it, but if I was gonna name it, it would probably be called Sterling. Um, as you can see, it's been used to make popcorn. You can probably smell it from there. Uh, it's also got one of these spinny things which sucks um, anytime you put something which is a little bit big it will like knock it off the thing uh, as you can see it's quite a small microwave so this is most of the time I was going to plug it in and demonstrate something but I thought best not to because I can't be bothered how do you think you operate this and you're like hmm gee whiz I want to put something on for 45 seconds what would you click on a normal microwave Perhaps you would click four and then five and then you go start. If you did that on this microwave, you press four, you put it in some weird mode, then you'd press five and then you press start and it would cook for three seconds. And you'd be like, I'm sorry, what? Uh, there's no explanation as to why it does this. Um, if you want to put something in, you have to click this weird wave thing. Yes, yeah, very intuitive. You'd be like, mm, wave. Yes, wave. I'm assuming that means normal because this is lots of weird waves. Um, not sure what that's about. So, yep, I'd like to normally use this microwave and put it on for 45 seconds and then you can click start. You get used to it. It's not the best. Um, I don't know what any of these other buttons do. This is obviously for the clock. Not sure how to use that. I don't think anyone does. This, obviously defrost, but then not sure what this is because this looks like chaos mode, whatever. Anyways, this has been my microwave. I hate it. Um, don't buy it. Thank you for listening.